Tonight, a Tarzana woman is breathing a sigh of relief. Her surviving relatives, kidnapped and held by hostage, or held hostage by Hamas, have been released. They are safe and back in Israel. Tonight, friends and family gathered at the Mizrahi home. Our Laura Diaz has been following the family's plight. She was there this morning that Galia got word that her cousin's wife and her three kids crossed the border. But the news is bittersweet because Galia's cousin and his eldest daughter were brutally murdered at the beginning of the attack. Still, the family considers itself fortunate. We got a notice early 5.30 a.m. our time on the family WhatsApp group that my aunt informed us formally that they were notified by government officials that our family members are coming back. Um, so we were, I was over the moon, I started texting right away. My kids, I woke up my kids, they came in to be with me in the morning, we were all snuggling in our jammies, and we were glued for, to the TV for the better part of the day. This photo was today at the hospital in Israel. Galia tells Laura she'd like to fly to Israel to see her loved ones, but there's still plenty of debriefing and recovery plans.